I'm Aaron Baker from Techno Buffalo. Day one of CES is kicked off in Las Vegas, Nevada, and I'm here at the Thinkware booth. It's something you may not have heard of because Thinkware is not available in the United States, and they're not available in the retail presence either anywhere in the world. What they're doing right now is focusing on OEM solutions in other countries, things like in-car tablets, in-car DVR, GPS, and more. We're gonna take a look at the T10Q. Let's take a look. So you got the T10Q here, it's specs wise we're packing a 1.4 gigahertz quad core Exynos processor. It's 590 grams when it comes to weight. And again, this configuration from what they tell me can be modified to match whatever the OEM needs. So if you're an OEM, you're walking in for your in-car technology and you want, let's say, a different configuration of Android or a different processor, they're relatively uh, flexible when it comes to that. You're packing a 10.1 inch display here as well with a 7,000 milliamp hour battery. So nice big battery. And of course, 1280 by 800 resolution on the screen. You can see some buttons back here in the back, which is what I was pointing at first. It looks like a volume rocker and your power button hidden back in the back as well as a front-facing camera. Now, juxtapose this to the T10S, which is the lower version of the tablet that they're showing off here at CES 2013. You can see some automatic benefits. Things like a quad-core processor make this thing super fast. And within that, that's a stock build of Android 4.1. You've got things like, just out of the gate here, some games, bus parking, 3D. And I don't know how much of this is installed by them and how much of this is what comes out of the box, but you can see a couple things like Glassboard, Media Spider, uh, Sketchbook X, and more plays video, Raging Thunder, a lot of different applications pre-installed to show off the quad-core processor in Android 4.1. Keep it locked on Techno Buffalo for continuing coverage of tablets. It's really the name of the game in addition to connected electronics and more at CES 2013. It's not a huge mobile show, but what we got, we'll bring to you. Hit me on Twitter at Aaron C. Baker, the company's at Techno Buffalo, and stay tuned for more CES 2013 coverage.